air tag talk. Uh, they scratch. I mean, I don't know. Is anyone surprised? I, I guess. Well, actually, based on your facial expression, Jack, you're upset. Well, again, I think back to the aesthetic thing with Apple. Like that's what they really have going for them. And if you show up with something like that, and you're trying to be the cool new guy with the new gadget, mm-hmm. like that doesn't mm-hmm. look cool and new to me. Mm-hmm. That looks. Uh, I don't know. That that's wow. It's really got to you. Yeah, I, I wouldn't be proud to be like, "Hey guys, check this out." I, you know. Yeah. Yeah. Well, look, we were working on with later case. We were working on a little thin case for this thing. Uh, you can see it. It's up on the website now. I have my concerns even with this, like having this product over here, because I'm curious that the back of that thing is so. Uh, susceptible to scratches with that polished look like i i don't know even sliding it in and out i don't have the part yet mm. i'll have it very soon i'm gonna test it out and see how it goes but certainly once you have it in some sort of protection it it would will not get scratched but what about just even going in and out yeah it's so soft right and we we've already run this test because old ipods had this polished back on them and and they always ended up crazy scratch but my feeling is with this product as much as uh you're right about being a cool guy having the latest thing this product is meant to be a little more covert it exists on your keychain in your backpack inside of a keychain holder they're sell they'll sell you a billion of those mm-hmm. they'll sell you the hermes f- uh three four hundred dollar yeah keychain which i know that's the one you're gonna go for jack show jack that one Cause he's gonna have to put in an order real quick here. There's like a ooh, specific ooh, link for it. Oh wow! Looking? Are are you looking for Hermes? Wow. Is that what you're looking for? These are because uh, here's our link for it. Here. Let me just convert it to US. USD. What do you say, Jack? Is Four four fifty for the luggage tag. But you get a free air tag. <laughs> oh okay. Well then. No, the air tag is twenty nine. So you. What's well, included in the Hermes? Uh, Okay, sorry. I know. So so track twenty nine if you like is a four hundred dollar sure. <laughs> is a four hundred dollar, you know. But you're still susceptible to scratches there, right? Like you're not Yeah, a, that's what I said. It's there's no plastic on the case. Yeah. You know what I mean? So it's bare. Let me tell you something. Yeah. You got that Hermes money? You don't care? That's right. Or you have so many that that's right, Jack. scratches, you just get another one. That's right. Yeah. Just to let you know about that Hermes. <laughs> what is that, leather? <laughs> <laughs> no, it's fake. Yeah. Oh, leather. Yeah. Well, I actually ordered this, by the way. Did you? Yeah, just for the Unbox Therapy video. I think it'll be a great time. It's just hard. To, I think when you have these luxury brand technology crossovers, because, you know, people who are into technology like to act like the things they get are not luxury. Like, oh, they're necessary. They're good. I need this in my life. This serves a purpose, which it does, but it also, why do they make them so shiny and good looking if that didn't matter? Mm -hmm. So, but this crossover always gets people irate because they're like, how dare you pay that much for a slab of leather or a purse or whatever it happens to be. Yeah. Well, NFTs are a perfect example of (laughs) people just spending money on nothing really. Oh, too bad we don't have Vin here for this one. He's got a lot to say about that. Mm Mm-hmm.